Being able to use your iPad as a notebook, writing by hand with your pencil, is one of the greatest features of this device, being able to write like a notebook in a classroom, take notes in a PDF, use a PDF planner, use it as a diary, or simply as a notepad, can be a watershed in your productivity. There are several note-taking apps on the iPad, GoodNotes, Notability, Colonote, Apple Notes itself, all excellent, but in today's video I want to present to you a great free alternative, today I want to talk about free notes. When we enter the app we have a basic structure, a side menu, where you can create folders to organize your notebooks, and in the main part, we have your notebooks, where you can view in the form of grid, list, and you can organize by date, name, that is, you can leave the app with your productivity style. By clicking on stationary center, the app offers a series of extra features, you can import fonts, templates, stickers, and color palettes, I found these extra features phenomenal. To create a new notebook is very simple, just click on this button, and you can create a quick note, create a new notebook, import a PDF from your own iPad, as well as from the cloud as well. If you are going to create a new one, more options will be available, such as cover type, paper size, paper type, checkered, with lines, with dots, or in white, in addition to being able to customize the colors. There are also custom templates for students. When we enter the notebook, there are many options, in the top menu we have some basic commands such as viewing pages, including new pages, viewing layers, searching, recording audios and in this button you can include photos, stickers, import documents, turn on a timer, useful for those who use the Pomodoro productivity method, you can enable the pencil, change templates, change the direction of the page, export the notebook, and activate the dark mode also in the notebook, not only in the app. I really like this function, but it doesn't stop there, there are several customizations of the page, several writing options, you can even select the language you write, to facilitate the search, define between the metric and imperial system, in addition to being able to configure gestures. In the side menu, you can include stickers, images, text boxes, activate the reading mode, and the coolest, you can configure your pencils and pens, the stroke, the sensitivity, the height, the colors, and this customization you can do in the style of ink pen, ballpoint pen, pencil, highlighter, and eraser, in addition to being able to create several personalized types, that is. On the side you can have several ink pens, each with a different configuration, I found this functionality fantastic. And finally, you can also activate the ruler. By clicking here in the settings, you can create an account, to maintain a backup of your data in the company's cloud and synchronized between your devices, you can switch from dark mode to light mode, you can log into your iCloud for synchronization, you can activate manual and automatic backups, and have access to backup history. If you are a fan of artificial intelligence features, by clicking on this icon, you have a chat with AI, being able to do research, make summaries, solve problems, check grammar, have brainstorms, and this is where the company makes money. Note that all the features I presented are all free, you don't pay anything. So in this regard, free notes becomes a solid option for those who want a free note-taking app. Because it offers much more for free than its competitors, however, the company monetizes the artificial intelligence features, because you can test the AI three times, but to have more, you need to subscribe to a premium plan, with weekly, monthly and annual plans, in the case of the annual plan, it is around $40 per year. Is it worth it? Yes, it's really worth it, if we compare what your competitors offer for free, Freenotes offers a lot, without to pay anything, the app is very customizable, it has several options for templates, fonts, papers, colors, you can customize your pens and pencils, you can include images, audios, edit PDFs, and if you want the artificial intelligence functions, then pay, if you think it is necessary. Download it now, test it, it's worth it. Thank you for watching, and see you next video.